Okay, creating a uh, route. In the KLN 900 we talked about um, flight plans, FPL 0 and FPL 1 through 30, but uh, the Garmin 155 here has 25 uh, flight plans, pardon me, 20 flight plans that you can store into it. And now I'm going to show you how to create a flight plan, or as they call it here, a route. All you have to do is press the route button. When you press the route button, cycle through the pages. I'll show you the page you're looking for is this one that allows you to edit and create routes. So we want to create our first route here. So we'll use this knob here to bring us from the scratch pad, route zero, into route number one. And we'll begin by activating the cursor and we want to edit a route, so hit enter. First thing it's going to ask you for is your departure airport, so let's call it uh, CYYC. There's CYYC, press enter, and it's going to give you the latitude, longitude, the coordinates of our airport, and it's going to prompt you to say OK, so hit enter, and then it's going to ask you for the next airport and it doesn't necessarily have to be an airport, it can be any kind of a waypoint. Let's call it the Edmonton VOR, so that's Y-E-G. Okay, there is Y-E-G. Press Enter. Gives you lat latitude, longitude coordinates of Edmonton VOR. And again, press Enter to confirm it. Next waypoint would be, let's call it the Edmonton City Center Airport, so CYXD. And it's there, CYXD, hit enter. And again it gives you the airport latitude, longitude coordinates, and uh, as well as that the airport elevation. Uh, hit enter. And now deactivate the cursor, and the route has now been stored.